Hey guys, welcome back to THFE. My name is Solid Snakey. And this is Master Debates. And today we're bringing you guys yet another minigame mod feature called Tank. Mm hmm. So this one was made by our friend Swash with the help of mods. So what makes this different from your standard old, you know, tanks attacking people is the tanks basically think of like someone just got bored let's say a unsc scientist just got really bored and he just took steroids and said oh why not i just inject this into the cannon of the tank so you get this tank cannon that just shoots a shit ton of shells out really fast and yeah it's it's pretty crazy all hell bricks loose Basically, um, they use a rapid fire mod for this game type, and it allows vehicles or weapons to use a, um, well, they fire like super fast, and especially for tanks, they just, it, I can't even explain it. Like, it's just, it's so crazy. Uh, it kind of sounds like, yeah. Uh, if you were holding your controller, it feels like you're actually firing an assault rifle at that time. But, um, yeah. So there's two tanks for this year. Uh, the teams need to be set up in such a way where there's two people on blue team, and it is, it is very important that two people go on blue team. Everyone else just goes on red team and uh, tries to avoid the mayhem. Oh well, yeah, you got mongooses. Um, <laughs> and right on the back of people. It's not really recommended. Um, but I mean, what I usually do is I kind of just like follow the tanks around, like all secret, like you know, just keep behind them so I'm just out of their vision. But, you know, not too close, because if they turn around, I get dead, so... Yeah. I try to keep my distance a little bit. You don't want to get dead. Getting dead is yeah. uh, not the way to play it. But, um, no. you can actually attempt to hijack the tanks. It will do absolutely nothing. You can do no melee damage, so trying to beat the tank or destroy it will do absolutely nothing. But, you can hijack the tank and just ride it around. <coughs> Good thing. Um... Zentai. God damn it. Uh, there is two spawns. There's the uh, red team spawn, which is right beside the mongooses. There's 14 of them. And uh, then there's the blue team spawn. Blue team spawns sort of on the side of the middle uh, level of the map. There's like three levels to it. There's the top, lower, and middle. And uh, blue team spawns on the side of the middle. Yeah, well, I mean, okay. Levels of elevation. The map's all on one little playing field um, where you have... You know, there are some areas that are sectioned off and like, kind of, it looks like a square that has like a cross in between if you look at it from a top view. But the, the map is, you know, it flows. You got little ramps, you can go off with um, gravity volumes, you can actually hide under the ramps, which I don't recommend because if you stay against a wall, the tank will push you, but it actually damages you, so if you're stuck in that little ramp, you're just gonna get killed really fast. Also, if you try to hide under the ramps, there's a soft kill there, so it's not recommended. Well, not all the ramps. Well, no, you fixed that. Oh. The more well, you know. Yeah. So if you're trying to be a camping little person, yeah. But, um, yeah. If you do end up getting hit by the tank, you'll just get launched on it. It is freaking hilarious. If you're off your mongoose, though, uh, you can maybe take about two volleys and then you're dead. So, run like hell only advice I can give you. Yep. But anyway, guys, thank you guys very much for watching. I've been Solid Snaking. And this is Master Debates. And we'll speak to you all next time. See you.